and you click on my video and then you see this scene right here and then you click away, you got problems, bro. Because this is the thumbnail. And what are you doing? You just thought it'd be something else? No. It's a guy with balloons. That's what you clicked on. That's what you're damn getting. You know what I mean? Now, who the hell is this? And that did not stop you from rising from the dead. It's probably the same as like being a child. They're ready to, to go. But at the end of the day, I mean, the Bible doesn't really, uh, it doesn't really specifically. I was gonna see if I could get. I was gonna. I was gonna get these balloons. Like you know, I was thinking about um, doing this as I walk to work. See if I get a car to honk at me. <laughs> dude, that's what I'm talking about. Dude, I'm talking about. God. First car, dude. Best like. Don't hit me with your car thing right here. What's good? What's way to look younger? What's a good way to look younger? Hmm. Okay, okay, okay. Here's the best tip I can ever give you, man. And this is real life, okay? I won't even, won't even Google this, dude, just so I can prove it to you. Is 80% of skin aging from sun damage, 90% of visible skin changes commonly, commonly attributed by, are caused by the sun, dog. Okay, but it's not about, okay, you have to remember this. It's not about, it's not about the all day in the sun. It's about the five minutes walking to your car for the next 30 years. Kind of it. Just hanging out with balloons, no big deal. We're just ballooning it up out here. So I don't think I'm ever leaving my house without these again. They really, it really just makes the vlog. You guys are getting a sneak peek for the new Fisher Bros gaming song. Okay? Damn, broke a balloon! There we go. There's the new Star Wars Survivor song. That'll be coming out later, later this week. Yeah, I need that and yeah. a couple of and some well, little wanna, brass. How do you want to style it today? I know you like to. You want to do like curls and stuff. Or? Are we all finished? Or? Yeah. We'll no, I didn't see the Mario movie. I'm probably, dude. I'm probably never gonna go to the theaters ever again, which I know is like a sad thing to say, but I wish I wasn't sitting here. Like, I was the kind of guy that would just be like, let's go. So when you go to the movies, you pay for the movie, right? You're paying for the movie. You're going to the movie. You're paying for the movie. And then you go home and you go turn on your HBO a week later and there's the movie you paid for a week ago. Dude, that stuff pisses me off, bro. I can't handle that. You pay for the movie. You go home. You're paying. You're paying twice. You think I want to pay twice? No, I don't. I don't want to pay twice. Easter! Easter! Nobody cares. Nobody cares. But I do. I love Easter. It's my favorite holiday. I love zombies. I love the original zombies. Jesus Christ, original zombie. And I love balloons. Gotta get my balloons in the shot just in case. Just in case a new person comes in. They need to see the the what they click the thumbnail they clicked on with the balloons and the man. Okay. There we are. Okay. You want two more stories that are just like that? 
All right. Think about if you were if you were uh, trying out to be a Hollywood actress, right? For you were from Wisconsin, and you were really trying to be a Hollywood actress, and you finally get a role, but your role is like killing children and getting naked, <laughs> and that's like your big time break, right? It's just something like you don't really want to show your parents, and then you go back, you go back to Wisconsin, you go back to that little house on the prairie, and they're like, "Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, everybody, Jimmy made it, Jimmy made it to Hollywood, everyone gather around, we're gonna watch Jimmy's movie," and he's like, "No, you know what, mom? Maybe don't watch this movie. Maybe watch the next movie, cause like I'm getting naked and I'm killing kids, and I you probably just shouldn't watch this role. Maybe the next role. If that's ever happened, that's super funny too. And there's one more. There's one more in this category." If you're a dude that pretends to be a girl on the internet and then you get a naked picture of a dude and you say ooh, oh man, that's really funny too. <laughs> People that are Satanists are so dumb. You're an idiot, bro. Okay, so if you're a Satanist, right? If you're a Satanist, then you believe in God because you believe in the devil. But they actually say that they don't. They actually say that they believe in themselves. But you're using the word Satan and the devil, which means you believe in God, kind of. Which means you do get a one-way ticket to hell. Like, you're dumb. What do you mean? I don't know if hell is even real. It, does, it sure doesn't seem like it is, at least in my life, because my life's so, like, cushiony. But I think Satanism is super lame, bro. And I think all of this stuff with religion and you, like, saying God sucks is just, like, you never, like, just, like, letting go and, like, being, like, uh, like, having an open mind and an open heart, really what it is. And you're closing yourself off to, like, that stuff. You know what I mean? It's sad. It really is sad. And to be honest with you, I don't even think that I, I don't even think I'm all the way there yet, bro. I am not in love with God like my family is. And it's true. It kind of makes me sad. Just have a nice time with your grandma. You know what I mean? Dude, you know what you should do, Duncan, dude? It's just really just go out of your way to make your grandma have a good day, bro. That's going to fix all your problems, okay? Like go, Just go a little bit above and beyond for your grandma today, dude. That is going to make all your problems go away, dude. That's going to make your hair look better. That's going to make everything better, dude. Either, but you're dude the god and all that stuff is real bro real bro and god it's not and it and it's it's all real and, and dude it's not it's it, it's not what you, you think it is okay god's awesome bro god made you think the devil's cool god made the devil the story isn't real yeah it is <clears throat> Okay, but do okay, but are you talking about like are you talking about the Bible? All right, think about it like this. The 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 um the concept of like we can't like like try to think about the concept of eternity, right? You can't really fat, you can't really wrap your head around that. And you can't really wrap your head around like you just can't, you know what I mean? Just like, what? So, to tell the story of Jesus, you kind of have to tell a crazy-ass story where people are like, that's not real. And, and, okay, if I'm really thinking about this a lot, I don't... People take the Bible literally, and I don't know if they should. All those stories. Like, li like it literally, literally happened. Like, that literally happened. I don't know about that. I'm just starting to go to church, bro, so I'm not the one to, like, talk to about this exactly. My brother is a lot more smart about this stuff, but I'm going to tell you right now, bro. It's all real, and it's, dude, it's not lame. You think that it's lame, but it's not. It's, it's cool. It's cool. <clears throat> the, the church music sucks. There's... <clears throat> A lot of the things in the church I don't like. But you know what? Neither does God. Because God made you in his image, so some part of God doesn't like those lame songs either. 
but like the concept of like God and like it's not the book. It's it's about it's about you getting rid of the hate in your heart and the and the uh, and the like the the you're putting up like a wall where you're like no sugar is good for you. You know what I mean? Like if you look around, bro, it's like so obvious that it's real. But I didn't really realize that until I was like thirty. And I'm not having a really hard time, uh, like, I'm having a really hard time, like, uh, talking about this because I don't, I can't really read that well. It's just like my pastor said Saturday without the, yeah. It's a, it's a hard topic for me to talk about because I, I just started, like, going to church and, like, caring. I, just because I finally was like, you know what, dude? This is actually cool. <laughs> this is actually cool, dude. 